Hi everyone, it's Giselle with a message for today and I would like to talk about what inspired action really means and when you have taken the inspired action, when you're starting to have a little bit of doubt and fear going, oh god, did I act too impulsively? How to get over that and understand yourself better and, and your motivation for taking those actions. So this week has been a crazy week for me. I've taken a lot of inspired action and changed a lot about my situation. And when I took the action, I took decisions very fast because that's the kind of energy I was in. I thought, you know, making decisions, I have to go with my gut, with my intuition. And I felt very calm and very good about the decisions that I had taken. Now, the problem isn't with me. I actually started to talk with people, friends, family about it. People thought who thought they knew me. But of course, when you go through a lot of rapid change, like I've done this month since starting the opening love and perception rituals, and, and I've done five more now, I feel like I am a different person. Like I've woken up in a different dimension. I am now in my version of my universe that is a lot more aligned with who I am and want to become. And people don't realize that, of course. And so they start bringing up fears and going, oh, did you actually do the right thing? Because I don't feel that you should have done that now. Maybe you should have slept on it or waited until at least the weekend and then maybe done something. But the thing is, I felt inspired. I felt this calm inner knowing when I did it. And, you know, that's all that really matters is your inner knowing, your calmness. Don't do something out of fear, out of doubt, out of, oh, if I do, like with a hidden agenda, you know, if I do this, then this is going to be out, the, the outcome. No, it has to be, I'm doing this because I'm honoring myself, loving myself, putting myself first. And this is the reason I'm inspired to do this. I'm feeling calm, happy. This is the right thing. So don't ever do something with the motive of, oh, if I do this and this will happen because you're going about it the wrong way then. So then I felt a bit not doubtful within myself, but then I thought, oh, God, do you think I should get confirmation from the universe just to just make doubly sure I did the right thing? You know, because people can really mess your head up. So I tried to get signs and synchronicities last night. I didn't really get very far, although I did out of necessity pull a tarot card. I got the Ace of Pentacles, which to me meant thumbs up from the universe. You've done the right thing. But then, of course, you start to doubt yourself going, oh, no, maybe I need more confirmation. And I didn't get my confirmation till I was calmly contemplating, not really looking for an answer, but just half meditating this morning. And I had the message come through that, you know, you did the right thing. Don't worry about it. You felt it in your heart. You felt it in your gut. You didn't feel stressed, overwhelmed or anxious or fearful. You had this calm inner knowing. You had this very strong calm, calm demeanor about you when you did it, that's all you need to know. And so I believe that. So I also want you to know that when you are looking for guidance, I know that a lot of people get readings with me and some really want it urgently like that day. And of course, maybe at the beginning of my career, I could do that quite easily. But now that I've grown my client base, I do say to you on my website, Readings can sometimes take up to five working days, especially if they're email ones and I can't connect with you immediately over the phone. You know, um, yeah. Please try not to panic. I can totally understand that if you wanted a reading, you want it now or you wanted it yesterday because you're in such a fluster about things. But please try to stay calm. Don't panic. And trust your feelings too. But most of all, don't get yourself all worked up into a fearful state. That's really not going to help you. So I hope that this video helps you and lets you know that, you know, you have a guidance system within you, a very perfectly working one. Just trust it. It's located in your solar plexus and it's connected with your heart. So when you get those two feeling calm and collected, you've done the right thing. 
Hope this helps. If you'd like to connect with me, all my details are in the description. I thank you all so very much for watching and have a beautiful day. Namaste.